Hello, this is Joy here. Today it's cooking day again, and today I'm going to make stoflets. Uh, it's probably the most traditional Belgian dish, and you can find it in all the Belgian restaurants. Okay, so let's start cooking. Uh, ingredients are actually simple. We only need stoflets, onion, and brown beer. Some other things like butter and some other spice. Here I'm cutting the beef in smaller pieces. Later I will cook this dish for a very long time. So cut onions small enough and then in the end you won't really see onion at all. Finish cutting ingredients. Most difficult part is done. You have to remember making some broth. I guess you can also use water but broth is make it tastier. Add some butter and oil. Add both butter and oil. Uh, first let's cook beef. Normally cook it until it's no longer pink and wait until there's some meat sauce inside. Now I'll stop cooking and put it in the bowl. I'm actually using a pressure cooker but normally you don't really need need it if you boil it if you cook it long enough but sometimes I'm just too lazy to wait or I want to I want it to cook quicker and then in the end I would just use, just use uh, pressure to cook it faster like this and now let's cook onion fry onion now onion almost done. I'm going to put uh, all the meat in. Now you can add some spice. You know, this, I don't know the name, I forgot the name. <laughs> and some other spice. I think one is tin and one is another. Add one teaspoon and this two. Sorry, I forgot the name. I think one is tin, one I forgot. You see the, the meat and the, the onion looks well meat the meat juice beef broth we made earlier yes of course beer brown beer lefe I'm using lefe because it's the uh, most common brown beer I find in Belgium but you can use any kind of brown beer I once tried with normal beer actually also okay but the most traditional way to make this dish is brown beer and don't forget to put a spice of uh, a slice of bread. Uh, don't want this crust bread here. You don't have to stir it. You just put it in front. I think I'll add a little bit of more here. And if you have mustard, it's also good to put a little bit of mustard on top of it. But I don't have mustard, so I'll just leave it like this. Now I will let it cook. I put the lid on and let it cook. On the, the medium high heat for around 40 minutes. And I will see you in 40 minutes. I think now it seems almost ready. So here is the result. I made Belgian stoflets and eat with Belgian fries of course. But fries I didn't make it myself. Just went downstairs to get fries. Bon appétit. Bye bye.